worried faces at a neighborhood meeting in Staten Island. A few days ago, two Mexicans were arrested in the borough and deported. Maribel Torres has come to learn more about the latest series of raids. The mother of two children has been living in the United States illegally for 12 years. I'm very scared I might be separated from my children and family. My children are very scared too, so we have to prepare for this case. The Trump administration says it is mainly deporting undocumented immigrants with a criminal record. But many here are still afraid. Community activist Gonzalo Mercado organized the meeting. Lawyers specializing in immigration law are also attending. They say the raids go too far. Uh, everybody has rights if immigration comes to their house uh, or their job. So what we're going to talk about tonight is about those rights and how can people prepare themselves also in their families. We're going to give them an emergency packet uh, where they're going to put all the information from their children, from their church, from their bank accounts that they can use in case of emergency. The lawyers explain that no one needs to allow the police into their home without a search or arrest warrant. They say neighbors can help by calling a lawyer if they see a raid. Gonzalo Mercado wants to bring neighbors, whether U.S. citizens or Latin Americans, together into one community. Having the whole community being able to be here and supporting each other is definitely a positive thing for all of us. In case of anything happening, they will show support and fight for each other. We've got to start here with uh, folks like myself reaching out to, to uh, undocumented people in my community to support them when their lives are a little more in danger of being turned upside down than mine. The meeting ends on an upbeat note, but the uncertainty remains. Deportations happened under the Obama administration, too, but since Donald Trump became president, undocumented immigrants in the U.S. are more frightened about their future.